Hey Brooklyn, it's Kaden. I'm 20 years old and I'm super excited to meet you. Okay, so I had to like speed round change for this date because I was swimming and now my hair is like in a bun and it's kind of a wreck. So hopefully this date doesn't care that much about my appearance because I feel like I'm a mess right now. The funny story about this next date is actually that his mother DM'd me about the, the like series and she was the one who was like, oh my gosh, you need to go on a date with my son. He's a BYU hockey player. He's so cool. And I was like, that's awesome. DM Betsy about him. And so she DM'd Betsy, a he's a cute guy, so mm -hmm. I'm excited about this date. Yeah, and we're going surfing and ice skating, so we're got, we've got like a broad spectrum. We've got a lot of stuff to do. So, so tell about what you had to wear too. Oh yeah, so I've got I've got a swimsuit on with all with like a ton of layers because we're gonna go ice skating, and I don't want to be cold, but also I have to have a swimsuit because we're going surfing. So I was kind of a complicated outfit to figure out like what to wear. I'm like barely breathing in like a bra and a swimsuit and a top and a sweater and like all these things. Uh, a little, a little hi. late. Good, how are you? Oh, thank you, they're beautiful. Thank you so much. Okay, even the little decoration has a mask on, you know? Okay, first of all, look at how beautiful these flowers are. Also, they smell so freaking good. I didn't get this on camera because we were in the restaurant. There's music playing. He plays hockey at BYU, the college, and he actually has diabetes, type 1 diabetes, and he does like all these firesides and all these like like service things for kids with diabetes and just brings awareness to that. So I thought that was really cute and really cool that he like does all, he uses his platform to kind of spread awareness and just to like encourage kids that they can do whatever they want even though they have diabetes and all this fun well, stuff. Well, one really cute thing too is he was saying that he wasn't taking care of his diabetes when he was younger and the doctor's like uh, but at, at this rate by the time you hit age 20 you're gonna not gonna have your kidneys won't be functioning you won't you'll have lost your eyesight and right after that doctor's appointment he watched the Olympics and one of the guys that was playing hockey had diabetes and so that became like his hero and he's like I'm gonna take care of myself I want to be a hockey player yeah and he like pursued it and he's totally done it and he's a whole function of his eyesight and all those things so like he's helping and other he's helping kids. other kids so it's really sweet that it's like kind of come full circle like his idol helped him and now he's kind of helping another so <gasps> <gasps> Guys, I got some. I got some merch going on here. What? I know. I'm so fun. So fun. Well, I'm getting a little pampered. I got you. Because I was struggling trying to lace up my own skates. Guys, this should give you a nice idea of how well I'm going to be on the ice. We'll teach you. Not great. You know that is cute. Know me too well. So cute. Brooklyn, look how good you're doing on those skates. Walk and I haven't fallen. Yes. So walking's a lot easier than gliding. Kaden's like taking us to all the background areas. We get to see where they play. So the Olympics were here in 2002, and they actually played in the Olympics here. No way. Some of the best hockey players in the world played on this ice. No way. So you're looking at the ice that the pros play on. A live game. Look at those crossovers. Look at those crossovers. We, we decided we were gonna have him go really, really fast and see if he can catch up with me while I go really, really slow. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm gonna start and then he's gonna start. Okay. You gotta point to where you are. <laughs> That's him. That's him. And right here, right here. 
There he is. Do you have a number? 14. 14. A real number 14. We got two championships. Well, not last year, the year before. So this was the Mountain West Conference Championship. And then this one was the Wasatch Cup. So that's all the Utah teams. So cool! So we got two championships out here. Basically, Brooklyn, you're out with a big deal. He's kind of a big deal. Uh, she's, cool. she's a bigger deal. <laughs> I, he said that the team got me this gear. Like the BYU hockey team, which I think is so sweet. What? I know. That is so cute. I know, it's really sweet. And I have a hockey puck, which was freaking cool because I've never played hockey. And look how cool this thing is. Like the actual BYU hockey puck. That is really cool. I know. It was really awesome. He's genuinely the sweetest guy. Like, seriously, so sweet. Like, every time I was on the ice and I was like, oh my gosh, I, I just know I'm doing bad. Because I all like laugh at myself. I'm the kind of person I will like laugh at myself and like I know I'm just gonna do bad. But he, he would get really serious. He's like, no, you're doing awesome. Like, he was so reassuring. Like, he was so sweet. Which I think is so nice because some guys don't know how to like be complimentary and he's really great at that. So. Good job, mom. Yeah, good job. You raised a good boy. shivering and my towel was soaking wet so he gave me a towel his towel which I thought was so sweet but also two funny parts of this whole scenario <laughs> one I hate it because I'm not I've never done this before Good and my like hot that yes we got that and my pants came completely off my body in the water and there's like all these grown men like watching me and I was like good I don't know if anybody saw anything so you did it I actually did weird but it was like my whole everything was out and then also i didn't think to bring underwear on this date so i like am currently going commando in my jeans this date has been sweet and fun but also a first time for a lot of things <laughs> All right, I gotta know, how was the date? It was super fun. She is a party, so it was a blast. Like, tricks, everything's so much more fun. You could tell she was loving the date, and you did the funnest activities, and I think my favorite thing was watching you teach her how to skate, because you could tell she's like nervous, but then you were like holding your hands. I think the girls are going to die when they see that. <laughs> I, I, I took her backwards, and I'm like, do you wanna go fast again? And she's like, oh, one well, time's enough. So <laughs> she's definitely, she's scared, but she again. What was your first impression of her? Uh, I'd say just how like genuine and nice she is and her eyes like she's so pretty and just like she's nice on camera and she's nice off camera too but like, oh, genuine nice. So. Yeah oh good I'm glad you saw that because that's what like I see you know and what would you rate the date? One out of ten. Ten being the best obviously. Ten for sure. It's super fun. One, oh good. One of the best dates I've been on. So. Really? Yeah. <gasps> oh good. Hey, thanks for the interview. Yep no problem. Uh, Thank you. Thank so much you. Fun. It was a blast. So Shout out to your mom. Seriously, he's the best date ever. You raised him right. Thanks, mom. It was a lot of fun, actually. Genuinely. Thank you. Thank it was you. A blast. And thanks for the hockey gear. Of course. That, yeah. that was so great. Of course. Yeah. Well, it's nice to meet you. Hey, one quick question we had. So, did you say that the hockey team got the gear, or what? What were you? I want to make sure we understood that. Right? Yeah. So the hockey team. Oh, no geez. way. That's, That's so right. cool. That's so cool. Thanks. Yeah. Shout out to you guys too. <laughs> <laughs> I loved it. Tell me your first impression. Uh, I feel like he was just seriously the nicest guy. Like he brought me flowers and he was like all shy and like timid and it was so cute. Like big gentle giant kind of vibes. Like he was just really, really sweet. 
Like that was a really fun date. He seriously like was so nice. Like did had the best manners. We had the best conversation. Like did you notice like he would pick up your skates? Like yeah. oh let me get this for yeah, you. Let me carry so this. Yeah, he was thoughtful too. Like he like the hockey team like got me stuff and he he was so excited to like show me around the hockey like mm -hmm. locker room. Just like fun cute little things like that. And it was so cute too. Like how everyone at the ice skating place knew him. And they're yeah. like hey Kaden. Yeah. Yeah, they're like, oh yeah, what's up? You know, all those kinds of fun things. So he was just seriously the nice, like I just, my, yeah, he was so sweet. Like that was such a good date, like for me to watch. Like I'm like, oh, this is so cute. It was a good time, it was a good time. Yeah, it was so cute. All right, well, thanks for the interview. You're welcome.